herb is healing of the nation. What's up guys? Joey One Love here. Dropping another one for you guys. Um, music brought to you by Revolution. Um, went to Delta 9 today. Got Cherry Diesel Sugar by Terrapin Double Bear. Now, I have already done a review on this. Um, I don't think it was the most accurate review because it was one of the first sugars I've tried. Um, if you look in my channel, you'll see, I think it's like my third video I posted. It's, uh, it's a mess. Uh, literally a mess. Um, but, here we go. A newer review. Um, it's a hybrid, a sativa dominant hybrid. Uh, a lot of people like this strain. A lot of people. Um, I honestly don't think I've ever seen a complaint on uh, Terrapin Double Bear Cherry Diesel. Not off the top of my head that I can think of. I've always heard good things. I was satisfied with it the last time I did it. Um, but the last time I reviewed it, I'm pretty sure any concentrate would have been acceptable to me. Um, now that I have a little bit more knowledge and background on concentrates, I'll be able to get a better review on this. Um, I mean, this is hitting at a total of 83% THC, so we'll see. And today, I had the decision to make this morning of going to Salivo and getting the Legend 91 sugar, or going to Keystone and get well, Delta 9 and getting uh, this. I'm still going to call it Keystone. Um, I went to Keystone and got the Cherry Diesel. Um, because lately, I don't know about you guys, but I've been personally feeling um, like Prime Concentrate has been like the same lately almost, you know? Like, it's as if I'm smoking the same shit, like, over and over. And like, you know, I don't... But just the last couple prime strains, strains, it just seems like it's been the same shit. Like, the same high, the same taste, the same look, especially the look. Um, but I don't give a shit how it looks, as long as it's, the effects is what I care about, you know. I mean, if, if it's ugly and it does the job, like, who cares what it looks like, you know. Um, but. a nice chunk. It looked like a little brain. <laughs> Honestly, looks like poop. Fell right out. And that's why I have a tray right there. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Just got a weed smell, you know. That's all I can smell is just weed. <laughs> Nothing special. Like a sweet weed. Now, a little bit about this. Unfortunately, I couldn't find much on it. But what I did find was that uh, the genetics in, um, on this is Cherry OG crossed with Turbo Diesel. It smells like really chronic weed, honestly. Mm. Rainy. I'm gonna break off a little piece here. No, I don't need much, you know. I only need a little bit. This is why I love concentrates, because you don't need as much, you know. Get a little piece. Let's see if you can see that pretty well. Now again, some people like to heat it up before they put the concentrate on. Me, I like to do cold starts, meaning I like to put the concentrate on before I heat it up because that way I can see um, 
when I don't need to keep torching it. Um, I tried to fit it all in there. Unfortunately, I couldn't fit it in. <laughs> so she said. Um, yeah. Sorry. So I guess I'm going to have to get a stand to like put it back so you can get a better view of everything. I'm working on it though, man. Like, unfortunately, I'm not even going to be do, be able to do that many reviews this week. My, uh, my car took a, what a fucking tank, man. Went down. <sighs> Out for commission. Yeah. Ended up having to put every dime that I saved, for new teeth, by the way, into this, into a new fucking car. This car's really nice, though. I mean, it's nothing insane, but... 2005 Chrysler Sebring Touring 30,000 miles Can't beat 30,000 miles, man Cheers burn my throat honestly got like a tickle up in my nose too has that ever happened to you <coughs> yeah <Whew. coughs> mm. Sorry, I needed to take a second because I was like, <coughs> I felt it in my nose. It was weird. Ugh. <coughs> right? Still another hit in there. <coughs> and that's one thing I haven't been able to do is be able to put like just enough concentrate in so I can just use it for the one hit. I'm never able to fucking clear the whole thing. <coughs> Going in for hit two. <coughs> I say this in every video, but guys, if you haven't checked out the keys the Keystone State Group on Facebook, check them out. And check out the Keystone State Reviews page on Facebook as well and give that a like. Some really cool videos, man. If you enjoy good cannabis culture and news and reviews, check it out. <coughs> I think I'm going to let this cool down a little bit. Before I pull that, see if that isn't as harsh on the throat or not. That one was way better. Probably dab too hot the first time. <coughs> Tastes good. Um, can't really pinpoint what it tastes like. <coughs> I can taste the diesel. That's for sure. You know how the diesel has like that. <coughs> like when you're smoking diesel flour, whether you smell it or taste it, it's got that almost distinct diesel. You know, like you just know it's diesel. Or some type of diesel. This has a lingering of that. Definitely. It's just like gasoline. Yeah. I know this review isn't exciting as some of them, especially with the good graphics I've been having on the Keystone State reviews. Um... This is a chilling one, you know? 
These reviews are the ones I'm just kicking it, giving it some time <coughs> for the effects to fully kick in. Mm. I can't believe my fucking car, man. My Honda Accord, man, nothing happened to it until just not too long ago. It was a good car. 233,000 miles is when it finally croaked out. I'm pretty pissed because the garage charged me $250 to fix a fucking hose in it. And then not even 30 miles after getting my car out of the fucking shop, the water pump goes. There's no way I believe that they didn't know that motherfucker was about to go and just wanted to get $250 out of me. Before they told me I had a fucking thousand dollar problem. Hmm. Whatever. New teeth are gonna have to wait even longer. Yeah. But it is what it is. You know, it's fucking life. God take what it throws at you. All I got to get me by is my cannabis and music. Not going messing for the people, man. It's my shit. It's great music. He's a lyrical genius. I'm digging this uh, Cherry D. I can kind of see how it's a sativa, you know, uh, but I, I mean, I can really see how it's a hybrid because I'm chatty, my mind is going, and I don't feel like going anywhere. <laughs> like, my mind's going, my mouth wants to go, but my body's like, hold up. <laughs> Where the fuck you think you're going, bro? <laughs> Crazy. Oops. Gotta put my medication on. Oh, you're on time. Wish I could afford a Puffco Peak. So badly. <laughs> Uh, they're expensive, man. It's crazy. I'm, I'll never be able to spend that much money on a piece. Unless I become rich somehow. But even then, I don't think I'd be able to stomach paying for one of them. But. You know, so, Cherry OG and Turbo Diesel. That's what's mixed with these. I never had either of them. But, but I think I like this cherry sugar, this cherry diesel. I don't know if it's because I hit it and it's too hot, but I can feel it in my throat. <coughs> Damn. <coughs> Shit. <coughs> well. <coughs> that's, that's that. Cherry Deals was pretty good. <coughs> so. <coughs> Alright, dude, it's enough. <coughs> Son of a bitch. <coughs> anyway. <coughs> it's determined that I don't want to do shit. 
<laughs> um, <coughs> but my mind is going, <coughs> going really fast. Um, I feel like this is great if you have like a desk job, you know, but I'm liking it. Um, yeah. You see it? <coughs> I'd get it. You know, I mean, I wouldn't not get it. Like, for me, this was the only... <clears throat> this was the only concentrate on the menu that <coughs> was even um, affordable. It was the only $55 concentrate on the entire menu. You know? <coughs> I'm not spending $75, $80 on a grand. You know? I'm not going to buy a half gram either because half grams disappear like they go so quickly and I'm not gonna pay $50 for it like I refuse like especially when on the street I could get an eighth of shatter for one pen you know why am I gonna pay 80 bucks for one gram it doesn't make fucking sense dude like I'm not gonna do that um <clears throat> but cherry diesel it's good um I'd get it but if there were other things on the menu, you know, depending on what was on the menu, I'd keep an open mind. But for this being the only thing, like, under $65 a gram, because this was $55, I'd, I'd take it in a heartbeat. Um, compared to the other materials, like, like if it was between this, we're going to, like, a, a vape. Or flour, I'd still get this, like, cause they had um, <clears throat> they had a, a good flour drop this morning. I'm pretty sure, like, they had SoJ Hayes. I mean, which is more of a common strain, but it's one of my favorites, SoJ Hayes. Um, some from Calypso as well. I don't know. They had decent flour this morning. Um, Durban, I think they had as well. Just regular Durban. Anyway, I don't know. Didn't really pay attention because it's flour. I wasn't really. That's not what I was there for. <coughs> But, I'll give you one more peek at it. I like it. And if you pick it up, I hope you do too. I'm a little disappointed that there's not like more of an aroma when you... When you smell it. Not much of one at all. But... I mean, I'm satisfied. I'm completely satisfied with this being the only concentrate on the menu, $55. Like, I'm glad I got this instead of spending $50 on on a liquid live resin vape, you know, cart, whatever the fuck. Um, so, satisfied. I'm not in as bad of a mood as I was before. I know, like, if you guys could just even have an idea of my morning. It's been a shit show of a day already. I'll tell you that. <clears throat> it's just afternoon. Like just after 12 o'clock. And, uh... I'm, I'm like kind of whatever about it now. Thanks to the Cherry D. But... Beforehand, I was... I was in a bad headspace, man. And, uh... It's kind of got me thinking, like, what the fuck? Like, fuck it. Like, whatever. You know? It is what it is. But, that's gonna wrap it up. Um, I hope this was helpful. Uh, yeah, check out the Keystone State group. If you guys are cool, go join. Just, only one thing is, like, we don't like weed snobs. Um... Just be positive, you know? All right? Thank you. Peace out, guys. Later. Herb is healing up the nation.